To present our next award, it's the Queen of Daytime, Elaine Crowley. Thank you, Deirdre. I'm delighted to announce the winner of the George Morrison Feature Documentary Award. These remarkable films bring the audience on a journey through the lives of others up close and personal. From life in the Gaza Strip and the complex story of a Republican dissident to the trials and triumphs of Ireland's leading sportswoman. From a Kildare farmer's fight to keep his land in a portrait of a vanished Ireland, a filmmaker grappling with the legacy of his estranged father. And the nominees are... Gaza. I, Dolores, bodies should be thrown out on the street to put the fear of God and the Republican movement into anybody. Katie. Yeah, I haven't got any family around or friends around, and I think just the emotional trauma of the last year as well. My friend is the image you missed a few months after your death. Filmmaking is nothing more than people who find themselves in front of I'll tell you exactly. The lonely tell battle of Thomas Reed. Because these lands of this area, they've been identified as really most appropriate. When all is ruined once again. We have the power to destroy life. And the IFTA goes to the lonely battle of Thomas Reed. Congratulations. Fantastic. Jesus, that's brilliant. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> wow. Incredible. Thank you very much. Um, I'm, uh, I'd like to thank the Academy very sincerely for this incredible award, unbelievable category full of such brilliant films. So on behalf of the creative team of uh, Fergal Ward, director and cameraman, and Tyga Sullivan, uh, editor and sound designer, I'd like to say thank you very much. Also to uh, Barbara Beeman uh, from NDR, uh, who supported the project, and also Mary Callery, um, uh, Derv Regan and Sarah Dillon from Screen Ireland, and most of all to Thomas Reed himself for letting us tell his story. Thank you. <laughs>